So, yes, and this would be the end of our shooting in terms of demo pods. And now Rene is available. So Rene, please, could you say a little bit more about uh, your demo and your product that you are showing here? So actually, we are showing NFC for consumer goods in general, also for access control or payment. But the main demo here is a new standard uh, by the WPC. It's called Key Kitchen. And what we are showing here is the upgrade of a standard induction cooktop uh, with NFC to enable appliances, kitchen appliances, to go cordless by just placing them on the induction hub. There's an NFC communication for the power demand. If I turn on, the power is requested via NFC and transferred on the standard induction technology. It's uh, also very versatile in terms of placement. You can rotate it. It's very safe because there's no port. What if it gets a little bit wet around or something? Uh, it doesn't matter actually because uh, there are no cables, nothing, no electricity, no contacts. It's pretty safe and even on a water kettle, for example. Um, of course, it takes a while now to cook up, but basically... So you just add NFC to standard induction? Exactly. So That's there's an NFC reader in the induction plate, a receiver in the appliance, uh, those two are communicating for the power demand and in the end the requested power is delivered via the induction hub and you can already see that the water is starting to boil in here uh, the kettle is getting hot but actually below everything is staying cool as usual and the nice really? thing is cool. uh, warm <laughs> it depends warm. But not on, dangerous. Not dangerous. Stable. On, stable on the on and the full mixer. power. Full power. 2.2 kilowatt power delivery. Same like if you had a cable. Exactly. But just without the cable. The nice thing is that this is a, a dual function hub, so it means you can use it for cooking. You can do your scrambled egg, whatever you want. But you can also put a cordless appliance on top, and the power is delivered wirelessly. And the key kitchen standard is also working uh, to make hidden transmitters. If you, for example, have a dining table, you can place it hidden below the table. And if you have a family come together and you put a cook on top of it, you, need, uh, you don't need to plug it in. You can just drop it on the table and it's working immediately and totally safe. Nice. So NFC is really changing the world. Exactly. Can you use it the correct way? Yeah, we are upgrading actually existing applications with benefit for the end user, making it more convenient, uh, more safe. And especially if you um, think about the smaller kitchens, um, with the cable you always have a hassle where to put it. You can drop over the cable. In this case, you just drop it into the kitchen. Uh, table and it's done. So uh, very convenient, actually. All right. Uh, it's an exciting future of smart homes. People will have this built in. And uh, it needs exactly. to be a common standard, right? It's actually a standard, as I said. Um, it's discussed in the WPC, the same group which are doing the Qi charging for mobile phones. And there's a dedicated group to it, uh, the um, Key Kitchen where uh, this standard is discussed, hopefully um, released very soon, and um, we will see uh, for sure first appliances as well uh, in the near future. That'll be a fun gift Yeah. before this Christmas. Yeah, uh, I'm not sure. Maybe Let's see. But basically, I would get something of those for my kitchen, for sure. Nice. <laughs> cool. All right. So. We are at the end, really. Thanks for watching, thanks for your questions. Shabak, are there any last questions? It was a little bit emotional, like, uh, as you see, as you show on the big screens, long time has mm. passed, and it's Correct. great to reconnect. Absolutely, you know, all the ST team was really looking forward to, to be here again, to meet our customers in face, to see the emotions, to, to have a discussions, chats all together, because I'm sure all of us, appreciate the remote way of working, Teams, Zoom and so on, but at some point we, we become tired of it and we need to come and meet together.
So yes, we are definitely happy we are here and we are looking for the next editions to come see you and bring you another improvements and new solutions from ST. I just got one question. It's asking, can it run Doom? Doom. Okay. Um, I think so. <laughs> Why not? <laughs> I think there are no limits. Huh? <laughs> cool. Thanks a lot. Okay. Thank you, guys. Ciao.